shooting an officer involved shooting earlier today 821 today over on the northeast side of Columbus. Uh, we are following that breaking news. We are expecting a live update from Ohio Attorney General Dave Yost about that shooting on the northeast side. It was at uh, 3204 Shelford Drive. It's near the airport. One officer shot at that time was listed as critical but stable has now been treated for his wounds. Another officer hurt during that time. Thomas Quinlan provided an update on his condition just a, uh, a short time ago. Good afternoon, everybody. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. You're all at least six feet away, right? Yes. I promise not to cough on you. Um, my name is Dave Yost. I'm the Attorney General of Ohio. Um, and as you are aware, the uh, Columbus Police Department has, or Division of Police, has called in uh, the Bureau of Criminal Investigation and Identification, which is part of the Attorney General's office, to conduct the investigation of the scene behind us. Um, this is an officer-involved shooting, uh, and the investigators at BCI are called in to do this more than 50 times a year. Uh, this is the sort of thing that uh, we have great expertise in. At this point in time, the investigation is in its very early stages. Uh, we don't even know what we don't know to a large extent. So I can share a few early facts with you uh, and won't be able to take any questions at this juncture. We will continue to update you as the work uh, continues. Uh, shortly after uh, 8 o'clock this morning, a multi-jurisdictional law enforcement team uh, conducted an entry on the house down the street that was uh, implicated in a, a long-term uh, drug investigation, narcotics trafficking, uh, substantial uh, weight of drugs, substantial cash flow. As they were entering the house, uh, uh, the resident there began to fire shots through the wall uh, at the officers. Uh, the officers gained entry into the house and uh, one uh, Columbus officer uh, was hit uh, in the vest and uh, also outside the vest uh, by the resident. And uh, it appears that uh, that particular, uh, those particular shots were fired uh, when they were within eyesight of each other. But the, uh, as I say, the investigation is continuing. The resident was taken into custody uh, and is being held pending charges uh, by the ATF. The officer, I am told, is uh, doing well. Uh, cur uh, consistent with CPD policy, the name of the officer will not be released until tomorrow, and the identity of the resident will be uh, released once charges have been uh, perfected. Uh, our prayers go out to this officer who is wounded and in the line of duty. Pray for a quick recovery. Uh, and I want to express my gratitude to all the law enforcement officers that responded to this scene, uh, both during the initial entry as well as the subsequent investigation. We will get all the facts. Uh, we will make those public in due course, and we will uh, make sure that this is a transparent and accountable investigation. Thank you.